Hello and welcome to this getting started video for the Net Backup Virtual Appliance for Remote Office. The Net Backup Virtual Appliance is a combined master and media server solution that is designed for use in a remote office or branch office. It provides a lower cost alternative to existing Net Backup Appliance solutions for environments with small data protection requirements. In this video, we will cover how you can quickly deploy the Net Backup Virtual Appliance in under 90 seconds. The Net Backup Virtual Appliance comes in an OVA format. To deploy, simply launch the vSphere client and select File, Deploy OVF Template. On the source page, you're going to click Browse and navigate to where you downloaded the virtual appliance from your My Veritas website. After clicking Next, you will then review the details of the OVF and then click Next again. On the End User License Agreement page, read through the EULA and click Accept and then click Next. The next few steps will set the details of your virtual appliance. Here you're going to enter a unique name for your virtual appliance and the location for where you want the virtual appliance to be installed to, and then click Next. Next, you will specify the destination host for this virtual appliance, and then the destination data store for where you want to store the virtual appliance files. Next, select Thick Provision Lazy Zeroed as the provisioning format for the appliance disks. On the Properties page, this is where you'll be filling out the properties of your virtual appliance host. Here you'll be specifying the host name, DNS name, IP address, as well as the network configuration for this virtual appliance. Under the storage configuration, here you're going to specify the advanced disk pool name, the advanced disk storage unit name, as well as your MSDP disk pool name and storage unit name, as well as the storage pool size. Once you've filled in all of the required information and click Next, you will get a chance to read through the final configuration and verify your deployment before clicking Finish. At this point, the deployment process and auto configuration process will run, and once it's completed, there are a few additional shell configuration steps required to conclude the setup. Please review the NetBackup Virtual Appliance Getting Started Guide for guidance. After this step, you are ready to use the NetBackup Java Administration Console to connect to the server. Here you'll be able to install your license keys and begin running backup jobs. Thank you for watching this Getting Started with the NetBackup Virtual Appliance for Remote Office video. And thank you for choosing Veritas for your data protection needs.